Hey, I'm Oliver. Now we will see from the radio all the switches and the stickers, how to control this uh, CAT374 demolition and excavator. And uh, first, already we start uh, the radio, and then you power on your excavator. It is operation now, already connected. So let's see. First, go to the function assign. Function assign, so from channel one to, should be channel, how many channel? Well, let's see, already channel 14. So this one is controlled by 14 channel. So let's see, check from channel one to start. So channel one, it is controlled by J4, flat turning. J4, it is this one. So that's for turning, CH1. Let's see, channel two. It's a big arm, it's J2. So you see big arm, J2 is this one. You can choose, also you can change. So this is for the big arm. Okay. Channel three, small arm, J3 is here, J3. So for each, so for each channel from the receiver, you can Click here to choose which is the stick to control, which button to control it. Okay, so channel four, the bucket, J1. You choose J1, also others you can change as you like. That's for bucket. That's channel four, now go to channel five, grab. So that's a spare channel, so we have two. Uh, this channel spare, it is there. So. You, it is controlled channel 7, it is a channel 5 VRF, it is this turning, and the channel 6 VRG, it is the right side turning. So you only hear its pump start and the valve open, it is not connected with any functions here, yeah? so it's no moving of it. Channel 5 VRF, it is this turning. Channel 6, VRG, it is this one, VRG. Let's check channel 7. Channel 7, it is for the middle arm. So it is this one. So SWJ, it is this press button. That's for the middle arm control. So this is a three section arm. Channel 8, left track, it is VRD. Channel 9, right track, it is VRE. And channel 10, hydraulic pump, VRB. So it is setting from this side, it is stop, yeah. So don't, don't reverse it, don't change to this side. If you reverse, change to our side, all your mix control will be different, no working. Yeah? It is setting like this. If you change, you have to change others to make it work. So, Hydraulic pump, VRB. Okay. Channel 11, SWD sound. SWD, it is this one. Okay, SWD, this one, that's for the sound. And the channel 12, SWB, this one special from now. It is choosing SWB, this one, yeah. When you switch it, nothing, yeah? This one is the sound control for mixing with the hydraulic control. So when you put at middle position, you, you I will start the sound area here, no. You see? You see now? When you are at, in, at this page, if you touch in this switch, it will change. So. When you are choosing which stick controlling which channel, like this one, channel 12, so you don't touch anyone. You, only when you want to set in this one to control it, you touch it. Yeah? Otherwise, it will be in a chaos. It will change which one you're touching. Okay, SWB, that's for the sound mix control. Go out, then you can control it. Sound start. Here is a hydraulic sound, hydraulic engine sound. So if you change to another position for the mix sound, no, no engine sound for the hydraulic.
no help. So only in the mid position, that's for the hydraulic engine sound. Okay, sound off. Let's check again. Channel 13. Channel 13, VRA. We will see. Channel 13, it is the cabin. You can change the angle. So when you are broken some top buildings, you can no need to head up. So when you're going up, it is this direction. When you're going down, it is like a, a backward operation for ESC. Yeah? Second time, first time you start turning, going down, it's not moving. Second time, it will start moving, going down. OK, that's channel. That's channel 13, go back, VRA, that's controlling cabin. So, and channel 14, it is the light, SWH. That's the light, channel 14, so that's all. Now, go out, no more 15 channel, so let's go out to check one by one. The controlling for end points. End points, so the platen in now it is forty percent. You can if you want to be more fast or slow you can change it from here for the platen. So for others all, all these are one hundred percent. Only the hydraulic pump it's different, yeah. Check from here. Negative one for stop. This turning right side it is stop for the pump. Already one hundred fifty percent. Why setting like this? So you will see. So if I switch all the way down to negative 150%, when you start, it will be very slow. The pump starts slowly. So if you turn to the middle point to start, literally start, but the pump still not start like this, when you mix control with others, when you start, we are going more fast. Yeah. Now starting more fast. Just start the pump. Okay, so when reaching the zero midpoints, that's already 100% of the running. Let's go out, so stop it. That's the pump. Others all 100%. Okay, let's go out. So that's end points for the settings. Go to display servos. You will see when you're operating each function of the sticks, and you will see how the control is showing, how much it is going from here. Also, you will see when you are moving, the hydraulic, hydraulic pump, now it is at mixed control. So the bucket, the hydraulic the arm, we are moving same time with the pump. So how to control this one, we will go to, to check the mix control. Uh, one more thing is another one, let's display servos, let's check again. So for channel 12, what we said, it is the engine hydraulic, hydraulic sound. So you see, you, when you're moving the arm, the bucket, the sound for this mixer, for the engine sound for hydraulic is also moving giving the signal always positive. So sound module 11, let's check. So when you are moving the track, driving it, or turning it, you see channel 11, that's the sound for the engine also is moving at the same time with the track and the turning. Okay, that's the mix control for this. Let's go to Pro Mix, you will see. Pro mix. So channel 12, uh, that's the hydraulic sound. So 2, 3, 4, channel 4, 2, 3, 4, that's the arm bucket. Uh, when moving, hydraulic sound will come. So mix control with this channel 12. Let's see how is the setting big arm. OK. Master big arm, slave, channel 12. Channel 12 is the hydraulic sound. So the curve. So you see it is only is going to negative. So negative, uh, how much, let's check. So it is negative 20, 
and going to zero. That's the setting. So this flat line, that's zero. This V down point, it is minus 20. So you can change it. You go to, you see the red dot, you can change it. Then you can move, move the position to, con to change the curve. OK. So we will, we will go back to the original one. That's the control for this. Hydraulic sound mix control. So channel three, is, that's the same for the hydraulic sound. Channel four, mix control with the hydraulic sound. That's the same. Let's go back to channel 11 is the engine sound with the track and, uh, and turning, spinning. So let's check. So channel one, it is the spinning, flat turning. So master flat turning, slave, channel 11, engine sound. See the control curve. So it is like this. Uh, the middle point is minus 20. The flat point, it is around minus 60. OK, also the red points, you check. You can change here to see it. So minus 20. Uh -huh, not minus 60, minus 20. This one also minus 20. OK, let's go back. Flat turn is on. Channel 8, that's the track. Same, uh, this track with the turning are different. So let's check again. Channel 1, spinning. This is the spinning settings. Minus 20, 0, minus 20, minus 20. Let's play the tennis, mix control. And uh, channel 8, left track. And the slave is the engine sound. So this one is like, so first dot, red one, it is 10%, 10%, 0%, 10%. OK, it's like this. So channel 9, it is another track, should be same. Must right track, slave channel 11. So same setting. Let's go to another mix. It is channel 10. It is the hydraulic pump. So this mix with must as a arm bucket and the slave is the hydraulic pump. So we got one, two, three, four, five moving. And also this six, seven, it is the auxiliary channel uh, spare distribution valve, let's start to see it. So channel two and channel 10, big arm is the master slave is the pump. Control curve, also you can change a little as you like. So from left to right, first dot, it is 75%, 75, zero, no, a little down, minus. So zero, you see it is a little up, so the down point, this is minus 1. Actually, from the photo, it is showing minus 20. You can go down a little to see. So if you setting like this, when you move in the, the, uh, the control stick, it will not start immediately. So more easy to control. 75%, 75%. That's the big arm and the pump. OK, let's see another one. This one is the small arm and the pump. Same setting. 75%. OK, let's pick small arm. That's channel 3. This is already checked. Channel 4, it is the bucket. Control curve. Same, this one a little bit different, so a little more. So also you can change less or more, so you can move it slowly or more quick. So 81%, 81%, minus 1%, 78%, 78 Let's check another one. Channel 4 already check. Channel 5. Channel 5, it is the grab. So channel 5, channel 6, that's the spare distribution valve. Also, we can see the settings. That's the, this turning the grab. So it is different, 100%, 100%, and 0%, 100%. So 5 and 6 should be the same. They are all for the spare. You can use as a grab or some turning 
This one is 75 percent, 75, 0, 75, 75. Okay, that's 5 and 6. We are not using this just bare. So channel 7, it is the middle arm. Middle arm, how much is the setting? So middle arm and the pump. Middle arm, so also 75 percent, 75, 0, 75, 75. That's the middle arm and the pump. So another one, let me see what is this. Mix 13, 14, channel 1, no, no more, it is off. You see, that's all the settings for the mix control. Okay, so this we all already check. That's all the mix, how do you set in for the mix control, for the pump and for the sound. Okay, what more to check? Endpoints. Display servos, we all checked. The reverse, we also checked. So, uh, reverse, it is uh, almost uh, uh, the arm for the controlling for the arm and the bucket. You can reverse it. The, sm the small arm you see is already reverse. So, for the stick, how you, how you move it, it is suitable for you. You can change it. But for the, let's see, for the pump, channel 10. Now it is normal, yeah? At the right side, it is a stop. Now you can mix control it. So this one, after setting, you cannot reverse it. Let's see. We already reverse it. So this side will be stop. So now no more mix control. Because settings, the positive and negative changed. So cannot mix control anymore. So this one needs to be changed back to normal. This, like this, it is stop. Mix control coming back. So, okay, let's go back to see any others. Subtrim should be all 0%. So that's the basic settings and operations for this demolition excavator. Okay, that's all. Thank you very much. Any other questions, let me know. I will be happy to show you what you like to see. Bye-bye.